G'day guys, Azza here. Been a while since I posted a video. Thought I'd uh, do a quick little vid and show you what I've been up to. Recently I've built this chip guard for the Titan TM20. Um, have to admit it's not my invention. Uh, if you look at one of Luke's videos on CRUD CNC, he did a similar sort of thing with polycarbonate. Um, me being a bit of a tight ass, I didn't buy the polycarb, I went for a bit of sheet metal. Just did some sheet metal folds and I had a bit of polycarb at home decided to use that for the front door. As you can see it slides in and out fairly easily. Little latches up the top they lock into the side and uh, yeah a little bit of engraving on the front. I stiffen it up by place, placing this aluminium strip along the top and it look it's quite easy quite easy to build I'll just give you a side view. As you can see sorry about my camera so I fold it, I think they're 20 by 20 just in here, 20 mil by 20 mil by 170 high. And these are little uh, 10 mil safety fold, just bent over the top and then at 90. And the sides are the same sort of thing. It's four bolts, takes the whole thing off. Okay, it's all pot riveted together. Anyway, um, you can see one of the bolts down in here. There's two bolts behind. It runs the full length of the table and as you can see it keeps all the chips in there and stops them going over the bloody floor. You can see here I've uh, cut the end of the vise too just to make it fit in there a bit more snugly. Alright look I'll put some videos in uh Just in case you're wondering uh, what I've been milling on the video, you can see it here. These are some parts for the Sieg, I think it's an SX2 uh, little mini milling machine. And the three of my students bought these. I'm just giving them a hand at home just to make some components for them, just to get them a head start and, you know, give them a, give them a, a bit of a, you know, a leg up. Good on you. Thanks, guys. See you next time. Cheers.